the initiative is a one of a kind industry academia collaboration to create secure and privacy preserving foundations for emerging Internet of Things deployments. Everyday devices are becoming increasingly intelligent, they're becoming more connected. This is bringing a lot of good things. It's reducing friction in people's daily lives. It's potentially making the medical industry more effective. But at the same time, it also creates a broad attack plane. So people can now remotely attack people and systems, and they can do it at scale, which is kind of scary. The problems are not just cyber problems. They are cyber physical problems, because the cyber and the physical interact these sensors and actuators are affecting the real physical world, which needs new kinds of primitives to tackle them. It's happening, and it's happening very fast, and we need to do something to inform best practices before it becomes too late. More importantly, it's not just an academic thought experiment, but we really want to have a real-world impact. And one of the ways in which we are thinking about it is not just about design, but also the operational aspects of IoT. And this is why we need to work with industry. One of the big things we're trying to do in the IoT initiative is figure out how to make systems more autonomous, so self-healing. So instead of having humans go and micromanage patches and updates, that needs to happen automatically. We also need to look at how to make uh, systems trustworthy, and then we need to think about how to make systems privacy-preserving and with accountability. CMU is a highly collaborative environment. We have a great breadth of researchers spanning all the way from devices and the protocols required for Internet of Things to, of course, the security and privacy aspects of it. It's also the type of place where researchers love to actually build systems and put them out in the wild. It'll be fantastic working with industrial partners that can help accelerate that. Delivering IoT security and privacy solutions that accomplish a lot of the security-related heavy lifting allows those customers to focus on innovating with IoT instead of wrestling with the security of it. CMU thinks about and prioritizes security like we do. We don't have to explain why security is important to us and AWS customers. They get it. We love to innovate and deliver for our customers. And we look forward to CMU helping us to do so. Attackers are always finding new ways to break systems. That's why Infineon's working with CMU to develop smarter, stronger IoT defenses. CMU's Scilab takes an interdisciplinary approach to security. The lab brings together top-notch people from across the university, industry, and government. And Infineon is proud to be a part of that all-star team, working together to make cybersecurity stronger. IoT is so much more than devices controlling lights and homes or tracking our heart rates. Connected devices control robots in the manufacturing sector, improve utilities and water management systems, and they're enabling more accurate and real-time medical treatments. AT&T is always working to ensure our customers' IoT solutions are secure and deliver the value promised and expected from us. This partnership with CMU Scilab and other industry leaders will help create a secure IoT ecosystem by looking further into the future of IoT. We're really sitting at a, a cusp of a, a new industrial revolution, and it's starting with the connectivity. So that idea that the data is the fuel that fuels this next industrial uh, revolution, working with uh, a world-class university like Carnegie Mellon, where we have students pushing the forefront in all these areas, allows us to, to sort of very quickly understand where the hard problems are and apply ourselves to those hard problems. And, and I think the piece that, that a company like Nokia Bell Labs brings to uh, CMU is that we have the hard problems, we have the real world applications, uh, and that, that sort of meshing between fundamental understanding and, and a sort of uh, pushing of the frontier with real world problems ends up creating very interesting outcomes.